The only thing I want you to do is copy this code and then paste it in terminal. Keep your eyes at the top of my downloads while I press enter. And you see that it just created a folder titled Notebook LM Ready. And when I open this folder, you see that there are 82 markdown files. And now all I have to do is select those files and upload them to Notebook LM. One of the main reasons why I believe you should actually purchase Gemini. I can't tell you how many times I've come to YouTube looking for a recommendation for what to purchase to only walk away from the video with someone telling me it depends. I'm not gonna do that. And I'm just gonna go ahead and tell you that if you're looking for an AI to subscribe to because you want more power more compute then you need to go ahead and subscribe to Gemini because it is truly the best AI that's giving you the most value for your dollar spent right now now I know some of you guys are gonna call me out because I still do pay for chat GPT and I only recently unsubscribed from both of my Claude accounts because those platforms do have very specific use cases for my workflow but if you're somebody just starting out, you don't pay for any of them and you're looking for the first one to get started with, get started with Gemini because it's going to give you so much value. There's a lot that you actually get with just a free Google account. But immediately when you bump things up to the pro account, you get higher access to Gemini 3 Pro model, deep research and image generation with Nano Banana Pro. Plus you unlock video generation with VEO 3.1 fast. You get 1000 monthly AI credits for video generation across Flow and Whisk. These tools are great if you want to create B-roll for your own content. You also get access to Google Search, Jules, Gemini Code Assist, and Gemini CLI, Notebook LM, Gemini and Gmail, Docs, Vids, and more, Google Home Premium Standard, Gemini and Chrome Early Access, and two terabytes of storage for photos driving Gmail. You can't beat this. This is a pretty good deal when you start looking at all of the different surfaces where you can enter at. Now, some of these you're not going to use but you're definitely going to use Notebook LM. And honestly, Notebook LM is one of the main reasons why I believe you should actually purchase Gemini. And then if you look at the final ultimate plan that Google wants you to sign up for, Google AI Ultra, you also get their highest limits and best model capabilities from Notebook LM. You're able to generate 50 times more versus the standard plan. And you're able to upload 600 hundred sources per notebook and each of those sources have a limit of 500,000 words and so the question is about your needs are you going to try to make money from this yourself or is this just something that you think it's nice to have there are people on Fiverr right now who will do PowerPoint presentations and investor pitch that designs in 24 hours. And they're charging anywhere from $25 all the way up to $200. And I have no doubt that a lot of this is manually created by people who are just great with the software. But I'd also be very naive if I didn't know that many of these people were using AI in their workflow to speed up their results, maintain quality and get paid faster. And it's not just presentations that people come to Fiverr and purchase on a regular basis. There are people who still come to Fiverr and purchase infographics. These are services that people loved for superb work and delivery. This first one, they create Amazon product infographic images and Amazon listing, Amazon plus content, high quality infographic design process. These are all assets that you could generate directly with Notebook LM. You can edit it inside of Canva, add your own unique touches to it so that it's yours, and then you can serve it to your clients. And all of these things that you see are easily created and only take a couple of seconds. You can create multiple variations and let the client choose the one that's best for them. But aside from all of that, the number one reason why I believe you should actually go ahead and just purchase Gemini right now is because of Notebook LM. You have so much data, so many conversations that you've probably had with ChatGPT. It is the most popular AI out right now, even though Gemini has knocked a big dent in that popularity. And chances are, it's the AI that you started with. Maybe you spent some time with Claw. Most people have not been using Gemini, but now that Gemini is maturing, people are migrating over to the platform in large numbers. And what's gonna happen to all of those conversations, all of those ideas, all of those great things you came up with when you were conversing with ChatGPT? For most people, they're gonna get lost. They're gonna completely lose that data, they're gonna lose the insights, and they're gonna lose the value that they created while using the platform. 
unless they do what I'm about to show you. And so what you want to do is come over here to ChatGPT, go down to your name in the bottom left corner, click on settings, go to data controls, and then click export data, confirm export, and OpenAI is going to send you an email where you can download your data. You only have 24 hours to download your data, so do it immediately because if you don't, when you click the button, this is what's going to happen. Nothing invalid signature or expired URL. The same thing goes for Claude. Go to the bottom left hand corner, click on settings, go to privacy, and then click on export data, and then click on export. And then a few minutes, you'll get an email from Claude that looks exactly like this. Once again, you have 24 hours to download your data. Go ahead and download it. Once you download your data, you're going to have a very long file name that says data. It's going to have the year, the date that you did it, the batch, etc. I want you to right click on that folder and change that name to ChatGPT underscore data. And this is why. When you get through watching this video, I'm gonna put a link in the description where you can download my Notebook LM Compound Intelligence Prompt Pack. And in that prompt pack, I'm gonna go ahead and add an additional page that people who've already downloaded this won't have, but you're gonna have it. And on that page, I'm gonna put a one-shot terminal script that's gonna take your ChatGPT data and format it so that you can use it inside Notebook LM. You're gonna copy that full command, paste it in your terminal, and it's going to immediately find that ChatGPT folder and chunk everything up into different files that are 450,000 words or less so that you can easily upload them to Notebook LM. And now this is where the fun starts because now I have access to three years of conversations with ChatGPT right here inside of Notebook LM. Now, one of the reasons that makes this so unique is that Notebook LM is a rag system. It's going to look for the answer. It's not going to generate an answer like Gemini, ChatGPT, or Claude. It just looks for a response based on the sources it has access to. Now I can ask all types of questions and do all kinds of of experimentation and studying of my own conversations with AI to better understand myself and better understand my future. And one of them that I can do is I can tell Notebook LM to act as a mimetic epidemiologist, trace the infection vector of my best ideas. So find patient zero, first vague mention for my top three successful concepts, trace their mutation through the logs, what environmental conditions, time, context, emotion, allow these ideas to thrive. Now that's complex, but that's powerful because it shows us how we thrive. It shows us how we developed ideas and how we can actually standardize this, turn this into a framework and actually create something that we can use personally to increase our likelihood of success. And so while it's fun to play with our chat GPT history and delve through three years of conversations to dig out all of the gold nuggets to go forward and then leave the rest behind, one of the most powerful use cases is over here in Gemini because now we can click on add files, choose Notebook LM, and I can add this notebook right here that's titled The Digital Architect. And what I should probably do is come back over here and change the name of it. And now we have chat GPT 2022 to 2025. Let's upload that. And now we can run the same prompt that we ran in Notebook LM with Gemini 3 Flash with one of the most powerful models on the planet right now, Gemini 3 Pro. This was a brief walkthrough of some of the things that you can do with Gemini and Notebook LM. And if you think the idea of downloading your data from ChatGPT or Claw and uploading it to Notebook LM is a good idea and it's something that you want to do, make sure you download the Compound Intelligence Pack because inside of it, I'm going to place the terminal command that's going to take that very large file that you cannot upload to Notebook LM because it's in JSON. It's a lot of metadata that's not what you need. And I'm going to give you that terminal command that's going to do everything in one shot for you, convert it to Markdown, take away all the metadata and break it down into chunks of 450,000 words so that you can upload it to Notebook LM with no problems and no headaches. And so if you got value out of this video, make sure you hit the like button, subscribe to the channel and check out one of these videos on my Notebook LM playlist to learn more about how I'm using Notebook LM. And as always, take care, have a great day, and I'll see you in the next video.